Good morning, Darksiders. Dave H. Darkside Kennels. So, I just brought the dogs their food out. They're eating right now. They're not even done eating. I haven't even cleaned the kennels yet, so there's shit all over the place. I haven't cleaned up yet. Um, I came to, to Sasha's kennel. Okay. And let's see. Next to the big pile of shit there. What's that? Oh, look, we got blood. She's in heat. Look at that. Yep, so Sasha started a heat cycle today. So now I gotta count off and try and get this, uh, you know, this timed right and see if I can get some poor bull puppies on the ground. So, just when I thought I was. <laughs> this shit ain't ending, man. It's all happening at once. Crazy shit. So, uh, yeah. So I'm gonna try and breed her to Vader and, you know, see if I can get a litter. So I just want to let everybody know, um, like I said, uh, I got a call last night about, about the try. I got a guy that supposedly wants her, we'll see. He says he wants her, seems like he's legit, we'll find out. Um, she might be going to California. I got this blue, don't sleep on this blue, man, for, I tell you what, for what I'm asking for this blue, this blue's smoking, man. You know, she might not be as, as big as her, but correctness is all, she's correct, man. Then I got, uh, I got Coco. I think Jordan's interested in Coco, but, you know, you got to come up with the money, man. You got to give me something for it. I can't give you the, keep giving dogs away, you know what I mean? You got to hook me up a little bit. This is a real good looking female. She just got a little bit of an underbite, very slight. So, I'm going to let her go cheaper and just, you know, and just roll the dice. You know, she's not even done, she doesn't even have her, her new teeth in it all the way in yet. So, I mean, we can see what the bite looks like when she's a few months old. Um, it's so tight. It's such, it's so slight, it's not even funny. And I got the rest of everybody's eating. I'm getting ready to clean the kennels, pressure wash. I'm actually going to pressure wash and bleach today. So, I'm going to pressure wash the shit out of everything inside the dog houses all that shit get everything cleaned up tightened up and then um, I'm gonna pressure wash my deck too and uh, yeah, if I can sell some of these puppies I'm gonna get this damn stone in here before winter comes make it look nicer in here and get rid of this damn mud shit I've about had enough of that I'm sick of the way this yard looks. It just makes every time I come out here, I get angry just looking at the damn ground because it looks like shit. It makes me look like a, you know, I don't want to be looking looking like a backyard breeder, even though it's in the backyard. Um, you know, I want to try and pimp it out as much as possible. You know, I mean, I got, you know, I mean, I got my fly traps. I got solar lights on every corner of the kennels. You know, all over. I got the air conditioning and everything in there the next the next step is a diamond plate the front you see how the front of these is chewed up like I'm gonna put those diamond plate sheets they're gonna go about four feet high basically I just turn the sheet sideways and then cut a hole for the doggy door and all the trim see the trim around it I'm gonna wrap them I rip it pull that off so that'll fit so way the diamond plate will fit flush onto the wall and I'll screw it in nice and tight and it'll look a lot better I might even change the color of the buildings in the, in the spring, you know what I mean? For this tan, I might go to a different color. I might go to a gray, you know, something that looks a little more dark side. And I think I'm going to get, I think I'm going to get somebody to maybe water jet me a big ass sign for each kennel, you know, cut it out, it says dark side kennels on it. I don't know, I'm just trying to. Make it look a little bit more professional. Make it look, keep nicer. Oh, I'm going to put a misting system in too out of PEX. I'm going to put a misting system in next. That's another thing I'm going to do. So. But yeah, old Sasha there's in, in heat, so. I'm going to uh, see what I can do with her. and Fingers crossed, man. We'll see what happens. But like, comment, subscribe. And I'll talk to you all later. If you're interested in any of these puppies, 803-504-9447. Peace.